filming outside wasn't a good idea. Hey guys, it's Claudia and thanks for clicking on this video. Today we're talking summer, you know, the lovely time of the year when the temperature spikes to over 100 degrees and the humidity is rising and you can't go out without getting bit by mosquitoes. It's just, it's a beautiful time of the year. I love summer, school's out, I'm a Floridian, so I'm basically in summer all the time, which is also why I would, you know, consider myself a bit of a summer pro because we have summer like all year round. So I want to share with you a couple of things that I think you definitely need for the summer. So just, you know, keep watching if you want to see this. So obviously during the summer, the sun is just beating down and it's hot. But we want to protect ourselves from getting wrinkles in the future because you want to be the cutest person at the high school reunion where everyone's like, oh my god, her skin's flawless. So with that, you're going to need some SPF. Obviously, throw on some moisturizer with SPF. SPF 15. Good. Yes. But not great. That's where you step it up a notch with some foundation that has SPF. This is SPF 20. That's, that's a plus 5 SPF right there. So you got your 15 and your 20. You're not getting a sunburn. Something that people often forget about is your lips. You don't want some chapped lips, you know? You want some luscious, beautiful, plump lips. So, baby lips. It's a, a middle school favorite. I used to have this when I was 12. You need some baby lips. It has SPF 20 in it. This bad boy comes packing in the SPF. So one of my personal summer favorites are some fun sunglasses. Let me let me tell you why these are great, because there are multiple reasons. First of all, blocks your eyes from the sun. Always nice. You don't want to stare directly into it, but if you wanted to, you could. Also great, because it's a really nice way to accessorize. And if you're wearing sunglasses, you don't have to put on makeup on. So that's like, you know, five steps you can skip. So these are two of my favorites. These bad boys are from Forever 21. They were recently in a haul that I did. That'll be up in the cards. And I think that they're really fun. Not too great at blocking the sun out, but super cool. These are also super fun. They're a little bit more of like a classic type of sunglass. And these are some Steve Madden sunglasses. This next item is actually super serious because we want to avoid dehydrating in the summer. Mine is a little uh, UF water bottle because two gators. And I recommend a fun print because then you're actually encouraged to drink out of it. A light one's really nice because those metal ones, um, they often will keep your water cool, but they're super heavy. Also, bonus, if you're going to theme parks during the summer, you can bring a water bottle with you and then fill it up with water at the water fountains that they have, and then boom, you have free water instead of paying like $7 for a water bottle, which is insane. And I think everyone knows that a summer staple item is a pair of jean shorts. I really love the mom style jean shorts because you can wear them with a crop thing and not be super exposed, so that's great. These are from Forever 21. They're like a light wash. Definitely get yourself a pair of jean shorts. They come out with like any sort of top, so I love them. I think you'd love them, so go get yourself a pair. Also on the whole, like, bottom clothing items train. Definitely get yourself a pair of floaty pants. These ones are from Forever 21. They're from a while ago. My mom makes fun of me because she said that they're not flattering, but honestly, they're super comfy, so whatever. I think that the baggy pants allow for a lot of like airflow and breeziness and stuff like that, so you won't get really hot. And these are perfect for the days where you don't feel like shaving your legs, so like you don't want to show that off, so you can't really wear shorts, but you don't want to overheat yourself in jeans and like pass out. So that's why you need some flowy pants because they're great. It's the best of both worlds. Sticking to the clothing items, you are definitely going to need some tank tops. I have some of my favorites here. Tank tops are great to throw over a bathing suit and kind of be a little bit more covered but not super hot. You can like mix and match those with jean shorts and have a bunch of different outfits and still be super comfy and basically be wearing the same thing every single time. Your next summer staple should be a little dad hat. These are really nice because not only do they block out the sun, they kind of shade your face too. So if you're not, you know, having your finest hour because you just went swimming and like are sort of sunburned or something, then, you know, you can cover your face up a little bit. These types of hats are cool because they can get wet and then like they won't be ruined or anything. This is my little Vineyard Vines one. It's really cute. Look at, the, look at that little whale. So hats are really great for the summer. Also, you can pull a ponytail through here or pull your hair through if you don't have a ponytail holder. And that's just a added bonus of the dad hat. Something that you definitely want to have for the summer in your wardrobe is a romper. I'm currently wearing one and they are great. And there's a lot of reasons why, so let me tell you. First of all, instant outfit. You don't have to think about it. You just throw it on. It's top and bottom all together. Makes it easy. Next up, they're super versatile. If you don't like the shorts, you can put some shorts over it. And then it looks like you're just wearing a t-shirt tucked into shorts. If you don't like the shirt, you can throw a shirt on. And why you should have a romper instead of a dress is because you want to avoid an awkward and uncomfortable Marilyn Monroe moment. You know, where she's like sitting on the gray and her dress is flying up. Yeah, 
you, you don't you don't want that next up definitely do yourself a favor and get some scrunchies during the summer these are great to wear as an accessory they totally amp up any little summer outfit plus we all know that during the summer heat you know it's it's a little humid out kind of gross you start sweating a little bit your neck's sticky and your hair starts getting stuck to it and just to avoid that situation you can throw your hair up and you don't have to worry about it maybe not looking the cutest up because it always looks cute in a scrunchie. It's, these are from um, Francesca's, by the way. So next up, you're definitely going to need a bag to carry around all of your summer essentials. This is just from Urban Outfitters from a while ago. So this one's particularly really nice because it has a bunch of small little pockets where you can divide your stuff up into. This makes it so that you don't have to like haul a towel around with you and like have your shoes in your hand and everything. You can all just jam it into a bag and then carry it around. Next up, get yourself some dainty jewelry. So these are some of my favorite necklaces. They're from Michaels. And you definitely want stuff that isn't actually like real metals like gold or silver or anything because if you're going out and about oftentimes you'll like leave your necklace lying at the beach and then forget about it totally and if you have some sort of precious metals then it's obviously more of a problem if you do that than with something that isn't dainty jewelry is also super nice because if you go swimming and you want to take it all off you can just take it off and then jam it into the pocket of some shorts and it'll all fit into there so that wraps it up for all the things that i think that you definitely need for the summer if you found this video helpful at all or you liked it then be sure to give it a thumbs up down below and if you want to subscribe to my channel where i will be posting at least once per week probably more then you can do that. It's that red button down there. I'd really appreciate it. All right, that's all. Have a nice day. Let's start running from us.